I'd like to accept your offer. Great. But then you went and killed someone, didn't you? How did you know? It wasn't exactly so. Uh, it was an accident. <laughs> Tragic. That's Bizarre, uh, even. Cool story, bro, but um, I think you had your own plans of getting out of here with that case. No, no. Pinning the body on us, hoping the white right death is so busy cutting off our arms <laughs> instead of cutting off our fingers. It's like Thomas the Tank Engine always says, simple is better. The kid show? Yes, yeah, the fucking kid, man. I learned everything about people from Thomas. Everything. Really? That's how I can read people like you so well, and you huh. are Diesel. I am not a diesel. You're the dieselest diesel that even fucking close. diesel that I've ever seen in my life, man. Because diesels bluff. They go too far. Man, I'm trying to get diesels out of my life, you know? If there was a gun under this table, yeah? I'd be as dead as that kid over there. Huh? Someone paid you to have the kid killed with his own ransom? Wow, that's dark. That is dark. I will stop. The hornet stings, bitch. Lady, you can have the case. Oh, but you've seen my face, bitch. seconds before the venom does its thing. <laughs> oh. Oh. Bitch. oh, shit, man. Do you have a backup? What do you think, bitch? Don't have another one? You gotta be better prepared. I'm mansplaining, I'm mansplaining again. I'm sorry, it doesn't. Uh, can I get you something? Uh, uh, you don't seem like a religious person. Water? Would you, would you like some water? No? You want a blanket? You want me to hold your hand? The assassin who killed El Saguaro killed my wife. But I 
seco y mato dos pájaros de un tiro. Can we just take your time out here? Talk this out. I will never stop coming for you. What? Wrong as far as you like. I will find you. Why? I mean, we'll ruin your life the way you ruin mine. Dude, I don't even know you. Toxicity of anger. I'm going to tell you a story now. No, I'm good. It's short. Really, I'm fine. No, it's very quick. No, no. It's a good story for you, I think. I'm cool. Here we go. A long time ago, I made a promise to myself that I would provide for my family no matter what it cost. I had risen to a highly coveted position within the Minegishi crime family. A man raised up to take my place. A man from the north. I asked Minegishi not to trust this man. Minegishi told me I had lost my appetite. He was not wrong, but neither was I. returned home and found nothing except ash and blood. The white death had taken everything from me. Almost. hiding. I searched for a way to strike out the white death without endangering what I had left. But he remained forever out of reach. I did not think fate would ever give me a chance to make things right. Do you know what they call a ladybug in Japan? Mm. Tentomushi. As a boy, I was told there is a spot on his back for each of the seven sorrows of the world. You see, Tentomish is not lucky. It holds all the bad luck so that others may live in peace. I don't want to hold the seven sorrows. Everything that's ever happened to you has led you here. Fate. That's a shit deal. At Kyoto Station, the White Death will arrive on this train. I will finally be allowed to make things right. My son is few cars up. If you could escort him off this train... Yeah, I don't see the White Death letting any of us off this train. You let me worry about the White Death. Okay. Thank you.